rules. As you can probably imagine, ladies and gentlemen, there are a fair few other rules involved as well. We'll try and explain anything as they come up. One of the most important things our knights will be doing is trying to stay as close to that tilt as possible, as close to the barrier as they can. So they'll now be warming their mounts up to the tilt, so passing by to make sure that they are happy and they know where they want to go. It's said that you want to be so close in you can almost feel your spurs brush along the woodwork. So that is as close as the knights need to be to make sure that they can score well on their opponents. And of course, this is true scoring, ladies and gentlemen. There's nothing choreographed in what we're trying to do here today. This is a tournament. This is a sporting engagement between these gentlemen here. And so like a, a football match, you can have uh, tournaments that are nil-nil. So we aren't guaranteed to break any lances. We will see how the mounts are riding and indeed how our knights have their eyes in. So perhaps choose. Let's see, ladies and gentlemen, who has decided to support the Knight of the Argo? That is the man in gold heading down towards us here. And how about those of you who've decided to support the Knight of Sir Lancelot? A round of applause for our Knight on the White Horse, Belladonna, down the far end there. My Lord Knights, if you prepare yourselves for the first horse of the day, Now our knights will be armed with their lances. And making sure that they can be released at the same time. When you are both ready. Dress Look at that for a swift start from the Argo. Oh! Ah! Ladies and gentlemen. A solidly struck blow from his mount moving at some considerable speed despite the heat. For the Knight of the Argo, a clean strike and break to the Taj, three points. Three points, ladies and gentlemen. For the Knight of Sir Lancelot, realizing his horse had stumbled at the beginning of the run, did not drop his lance knowing that it could cause harm for either his opponent or his opponent's mount. For this, I shall award one point for chivalrous conduct. One point for chivalry there. Not wanting to strike if it could cause injury. An Squires. excellent display of horsemanship there. Squires, are the knights fit to continue? Then prepare yourselves for the second course of the day. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as soon as you see them fly, do you give them your cheers. And you're ready. Let's go. Oh, very close there. But it looked like our Knight of the Argo might have been riding.